Hey there guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Super Luigi 3D Land. So, in the last episode, we finished off Special World 1 and unlocked Luigi from Bowser's evil clutches. For some reason, he determined that Peach was too easy to steal. So he's like, you know what, I'm gonna go after the taller brother instead. And we rescued as him, or we, we, we rescued as him, we rescued him, and uh, there was some serious popular demand for playing as Luigi. So, uh, what can I say? I'm a sucker for popular demand sometimes. So here we are. Luigi, he is, uh, he is a guy. <laughs> He's a lot more slippery. He takes a lot of getting used to. I kind of suck playing as him, uh, if I'm being honest here. He's just... He's a lot looser of a character, just like he is in Super Mario Galaxy, really. And I'm not great with him in Galaxy, either. But... I find myself, like, sliding off edges accidentally and stuff, so hopefully we can... Uh, we cannot do that on camera. That would be very depressing. Break out my leaf before... before we continue here. Having a Tanuki leaf inside auto-scrolling levels, especially ones where, like, you're... You've got your head in the clouds the whole time. Can be a lifesaver. Also, where am I? I am just all sorts of upstairs. And there's your second coin, too, randomly sitting there. I hardly even got to see it on camera before I had it and was off and away with it. Grab some coins here. Don't miss that jump. Oftentimes, I actually... It's a little weirder of a thing. However, I won't get enough of a running start on... And actually, you can just jump right up here and get that that way. Uh, but I won't get enough of a running start on a jump, and I'll just, like, jump um, directly into a hole. Also, hello, Mr. Coin. Let's see if we can do this from right here. Hello, flag. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. No need for those rolling jumps. And we got our first gold flag as Luigi. It is all a Luigi-type-esque flag instead of it's not... It's no, no M's are had by that flag. How many flags is that M having? I can't get my pronouns in the right order to say sentences. This is going to be problematic. Oh, hello there, 30 second timer. I guess we should probably be on our way. Uh, oh hey, you, you stay as the, you stay as the statue even underwater. That's kinda, that's kinda neat. So like, yeah, you can just turn into the statue whenever. I'm not used, I don't normally try to do that underwater, I guess, because I've never really, never really encountered that. However, you can't be the statue while you go through Mr. Pipe, though. That would just be unacceptable. I tried to kill me some birds so we could have some some chicken soup for dinner, but... Or whatever type of bird those were. What type of bird were those, actually? Oh, ow! Luigi! That is not how you're supposed to shot web. That is... No! I was supposed to turn into a statue and or hit that thing with my tail and then turn it into... into change. However... That did not happen at all. Instead, I lost my tail, and I have nothing to show for it now. I'm not getting any tail tonight, what can I say? Get back underwater, That we've lost our Stone Cold Steve Argus powers here, too. God, Four Swords Adventures is going so well. I, that's, a, that's a very fun game. No spoilers, I'm not giving any spoilers. Except Patrick, Josh, and NCS are involved. If you haven't been watching it, it is a collab. I've been doing if you haven't been watching it what's up with what's up with that it's on my channel you should have seen it and been like oh hey it's a game it has people in it i like people i'm gonna watch it that should have been your logical thought process if that wasn't and or if you're not watching it i'm sorry you are missing out be glad you're not editing it though <laughs> that takes forever and a day possibly even forever and two days Actually, more like a week. Forever and a week. Because it, it comes out every Saturday, and it does take pretty much that whole week to edit. I have to crop and render each of the Game Boy videos separate, and then fade in and fade them out whenever someone gets on the Game Boy screen. It, it takes some time. And that's that's all I'm going to say about that. I'm getting off topic here. This That's in a completely different, completely different LP. Ooh, I love this level. These levels that have the have the carts on them, the auto, like the rolly carts here, I love these so much. Well, one, their music is wonderful. It sounds like that, uh, the final Bowser level from World 8, because that had one of these rolling carts, except it was like the, the skull raft instead. 
Ooh, and there's a there's a tanuki tanuki leafy tail of goodness up here. Let's get. Oh no no no! And now we get it. Okay, that was actually kind of worth it, except for the fact that I really didn't have to take a hit to get that at all. However, this the tanuki tail is pretty awesome to have in this level for a number of reasons. Uh, not the least of which is you can actually destroy pretty much everything in the world with it. So let's get Mr. Coin here, and then... Aha! We see we can just smash those things to pieces, and they all go away. And you don't even have to, like... I happened to time it well enough that I was able to land directly on... directly on it and kill it that way. If you're just sitting on the raft as a stone and it hits you, it's still going to... It's still gonna die. So you can even do that. It's not like you have to be super, super tricksy about it or anything. It's really uh, quite straightforward, actually. Oh, by, by the way, don't miss that coin there. That is a very, very easy coin to... Ah, uh, there's no way I'm gonna make that jump. We will wait for this guy to blow his load, load again, and I'm starting to sound like Tyler, what is going on with me? And we'll wait here. This this piece of waterfall right here takes like forever. I think this is probably enough waiting. Please, oh please, oh please, oh please, oh please, oh please, no! Oh my god, I should have been dead. I should have so been dead. That was way too close for comfort. Okay. However, that one star coin is very, very easy to miss. So don't accidentally miss it. I probably spent a good 25 minutes searching for that the first time I played through this game. That was one of the last ones I found, as I recall. So come back here and get star coin number three. Or star metal. Sorry, star metal. I'm probably going to call these things star coins this entire LP. I've been doing it thus far. No reason I shouldn't continue. Turn into stone Luigi here so you don't get hit by, by Mr. Fuzzies. Or Mrs. Fuzzies. I mean, if there's a Mr. Fuzzy, there has to be a Mrs. Fuzzy. So, why couldn't those have been Mrs. Fuzzy? I call everything Mr. Maybe that makes me sexist. I'm not sexist, I promise. Seriously, I promise. Water time. I'm pretty sure water makes the world go round. And if it doesn't, water covers the earth and makes it round. Water doesn't actually, I don't think, have anything to do with the shape of the Earth, but it does cover the Earth. So I at least said one truthful statement in there somewhere. I'm pretty sure. There must be one thing I've said in this video so far that was truthful. Oh, this is another awesome level as well. Because it has the, the propeller hat, which I really enjoy because it's a propeller hat. I mean, let's be honest here, who doesn't like propeller hats? They are pretty much the most fun ever. Come up here, get your first star medal. However, the level's also all ice-themed, and happy-looking, and snowy, and white, and the seven dwarves, and all sorts of stuff. I'm a big... I love... I love the snow, and I love the winter, so levels like this, and even Hailfire Pete's, and Freeze Easy Pete, and, um, and those Banjo-Kazooie snow levels, and just... Snow levels in general, they really do it for me. I like their... I like their ambiance. So pardon me while I while I gush over some snow levels. Even like the Donkey Kong Country snow levels, those are really good too. I realize I'm naming off a whole bunch of rare games here. Maybe rare just makes ridiculously good snow levels. Uh, that's completely possible, actually. Though this is this is not a rare game. This is a Nintendo game. God, I wish Rare was still owned by Nintendo. That would be pretty much the best thing. So right up here is where we want to go. However, right down here is star metal number three. So, oh no, that was a very poor jump by me. And crushy, crushy, turn you all into lives. And I think I even got all your coins there. So, double what? What are you going to do about that, Mr. Goomba, now that you've been turned into loose change? Do you feel minimalized in your life? Do you feel unimportant? Good, because you are. You don't matter at all. So go back and be a minion. I'm sorry, Goomba, that was harsh of me. I hope I didn't cause you any undue mental illness so that you have to go see a psychiatrist. Please don't sue me. Psychiatrists are expensive. I don't want to have to pay for that. No game, I will not take a break. You know why? Because I'm not done with this world. Once we're done with Special World 2, then, then I will take a break. But until then, I will not rest, I will not sleep, I will not stop saying words, most likely. If I do, please call an ambulance. I may or may not be dead. 
and or my voice my voice box could very well give out. That that does happen from time to time. There is a secret not so secret tanuki leaf right in there that you can get. So let's just forego that whole secondary thing. And bounce on a bee and make it back up without any platforms. Thank you, Mr. B. That could not have been more opportune for me. And I might have screwed it up by only getting that one. No, we can just float. We want to get right down here into that one. So it's gonna spit us right back out here into a into a star metal that you might not otherwise have seen. We still don't need that path on the right, because the one we're actually going for now is the one way right out here. The one we didn't go in last time that was really far away. That is that is the magic one that leads you onward. The other one just led you to that one little, like, time clock thing. Also, try not to get trapped inside this. It makes a nice little mountain. Um, mountain of green little blocks that's very, very simple to get trapped inside if you're not careful. That's kind of like the the thing. It's just hit them all and then run outside, because once you're outside, the mountain becomes very easy to climb. However, once you're trapped inside, it's pretty much game over until they disappear. So, this one's only like too long. It's like, really? I could have jumped that. That could have been difficult. This is Special World 2, after all. Oh, I messed that up. However, it worked out nonetheless simply for the fact that I have a Tanuki Leaf. That kind of is saving my life this episode. Good job, Luigi. You're, you are not so hard to control anymore. Now that I'm kind of getting used to how your slip-slide-away-ness is, he kind of controls, like, he controls, like, what I imagine the penguin in, in Super Mario 64 would control, like, as you're sliding down the slide, and he's just all over the place. However, when he really needs to, like, take a tight corner, he still has those really tight controls. Those pre-scripted controls. <laughs> that's what I imagine he controls like, and that's how Luigi controls. He seems really slippery, but when it really counts, he's got your back. He knows what's up. He knows the score. The score is 3-2 Detroit Tigers versus the New York Giants. I think I just missed a football team and a baseball team. Let's throw in... I was gonna try to throw in a hockey team, but I don't know any hockey teams. Uh, the Canucks. That, I'm pretty sure that's a hockey team. <laughs> I know nothing about hockey, though. So I'm sorry to all you hockey lovers. I'm ignorant to your sport. Um, oh. Hello, Luigi. I managed to just slide right off an edge with you. That is glorious. Luckily, I just, just got a midpoint there, or a... A Czechy flag of goodness. Not to be confused with, like, the flag for the Czech Republic. It's a little different than that. Not that kind of Czech flag. Or a checkered flag. Didn't get one of those either. Don't get hit by bonsai bills. Don't get hit by spiky things. Just run and then right down here. Don't get hit by these spiky things either. Always a good idea to probably just wait. And then jump right up here and run! Run, Luigi, run! Don't get hit by... Oh, man. Okay, that wasn't as close as I thought it was going to be. thought it was going to be far closer than that and then possibly lead to my death. Also, this airship is really weird. There is zero boss on this airship. Uh, it's pretty much just like, hey, there's bonsai bills everywhere. And then spikes as well. Other than that, grab three star medals and be on your merry way. And that's all there is to it. And that is a giant Luigi flag. So that wasn't so bad. We didn't even have any bosses to fight. It was just like, here, take a ride on my airship. It'll transport you places, maybe. Otherwise, it'll just spin here in circles and fire off blanks out of its cannons. So, uh, next time on Let's Play Super Luigi Mario 3D Land World, um, we will do Special World 3. So, until then, thank you guys so very much for watching this, and I hope you're having a fantastic day.